welcome back guys it has been a minute but we are out in the field harvesting black bean harvest has started we are on day number three so we are on the first field this should finish up this get this truck full this will finish up this field got a small 10 acre field across the road and we're moving on from here so getting the worst field out of the way this field had some mold in it but we are plugging away at it it's finally dry enough to run so yeah dad's just getting going and we will see how today goes Okay, so in this field we did have a little mold problems and we'll see, let's see if we can pick it up on camera. See that dark strip? So that's a little bit of a low spot in this field and that's where the mold set in. You can see that the bushes are darker. Um, some of the pods are on the ground. The plant's darker. See how dark those pods are versus the ones just a little bit over. These here are nice and light colored and yep so that's the difference so we'll crack one open here so this is a black bean this is a grows kind of similar to a green bean but you just let them die and you just take the seeds so we'll crack one open so there you have it you have the seed that you want is the black bean seed if you can see that and then there's the hull so combine separates the hull threshes out the seed that's what you want and that is what we put in the truck and haul away first field done we are going just through the fence over there to the other side of the road dad's gonna try to go around to by the barn I'm gonna go get the truck we're gonna try to not to take the head off but I'm afraid we might have to the new heads five foot wider than the old one and the old one was tight so we will see I'll hop in the truck and follow him and see once if we can do this well we tried it this head will not fit through the barnyard like the old one does so we got the trailer out Got this hooked up. Got a new header cart for it too. So when you add five foot to the head, it is a lot harder to get in and out of driveway. So this cart has four wheel steer. So the back trail is a lot nicer. So we'll take the head off, pop across the road and get back to combining. When you don't got a grassy spot by the field, put the head on right in the middle of the road. At least no one was coming today. <laughs> but you take up the whole road. Go get it opened up. I'll drop the heading start in the field and knock this little 10 acre field out. Then we're probably done for the day. The truck should be almost full. Here he goes, opening up the field. I'm just walking to get the truck. Looks like I picked the wrong side to walk across from him, but it's gonna get covered in dust. <laughs> okay, we just had a bit of a problem. Had a bunch of bean chaff get jammed up underneath the belts on the head. So not sure what made that. The belts were not turning so it was it stopped and it wasn't feeding anymore so we took it apart dug that out dad's making 
Another round seems to be going good. Got a beautiful harvest sunset going on. So we'll go get some shots of the combine just as the sun is setting. Enjoy. up another day of bean harvest not sure if we're gonna move the combine yet tonight after that ordeal so we might just leave it here let's see once but we'll have another truck load off we'll get this field done tonight and then we got to move a few miles to the next field and continue on so thanks for watching and I'll catch you on the next one